Hi, tech students, and welcome to the weekly Raven Report. I'm Tegan Horn. I'm Juliana. No last name given. I'm Just sorry. <laughs> For our first story. New, new semester. Welcome to the second semester, everyone. Oh, welcome to the second semester, everybody. The first big news we have is that students will now need to begin using their lunch key bag codes to access school meals. It has been almost two years since we have used these codes, if ever. But a reminder that students' first lunch and breakfast will still be free. After that, though, your second breakfast or lunch will be charged. If you will be having a second lunch or breakfast, please add money to your account through Skyward Family Access. They will not be taking cash or, or check for payment. And again, your lunch code keypad, your lunch keypad code should have been given to you on the first period Monday. But if you had, um, if you have not received it, then please check to your, to the counselor, sorry. And in other news, today, February 1st, not today, but was Chinese New Year, or also known as Lunar New Year. 2022 marks the year of the tiger in the Chodiac and Zodiac thing, calendar. <laughs> the celebration of Chinese New Year traditionally lasts 16 days, starting from Chinese New Year's Eve to the Lantern Festival, which is from January 31st to February 15th. The date of Chinese New Year changes each year, but um, the date is decided by the Chinese Lunar calendar. The recent years of the Tigers are 1938, 1950, 1962, 1974, 1986, 1998, 2010, and 2022. The people born in the year are predicted to be competitive, brave, unpredictable, and confident. If you're curious on what your zodiac animal sign is, see our iTech 22 page for the link to find out. I'm pretty sure I'm a monkey. Everyone's a monkey. I'm pretty sure not everyone. Well, that's true. No, but our senior year, all of us are monkeys. Okay, yeah, we're monkeys. Yeah. <laughs> and speaking of seniors, senior pictures were due last week. But if you haven't gotten them in by now, no big deal. You do have a two-week grace period to redo that standard. Just kidding. Mr. Hurst is silent, mad, and has a very particular set of skills. Skills that he's acquired over a very long career. Skills that have, that make him a nightmare for people like you. If you turn in the senior photos now, that will be the end of it. He will not look for you. He will not pursue you. But if you don't, he will look for you. He will find you. And he will take an embarrassing picture of you and put it in the yearbook. This is your warning. And your only warning. Anyway, guess what we have now? We have a piano. It's located in the copy machine room on the second floor, room 207, where music clubs meet. Speaking of music club, feel free to join music club. They meet every Friday afternoon from after school starts at 5 p.m. Students bring their own instruments to play with others. Well, you are also welcome to join and listen or talk about music in general. Yay. Back to the piano, it's a playing piano, meaning it has some engineering features in it, which allows it to play by itself, itself based on these roles that we are hoping students will design their own roles for it, for it to play. Only iTech, only iTech would get a self-engineered piano instead of a normal piano. It's a nice piano, out of it two. Is. But it's why, why? Why actually learn music when you can just teach a piano to learn music itself? It's reality. It's eye tech. I mean, reality. Before our next story, we have a hearing and vision screen planned for Wednesday, February 9th. First thing in the morning. It will be in the cafe, and there will be three nurses, so we should be able to get through it quickly likely about one hour seventh graders are the only ones we are required to test well if there is 
a student that is in a different grade that might need tested for whatever reason, send them down. <laughs> Congratulations to iTech Robotics Team 3249R for qualifying for the state and bringing home the design award from the Willamette High School Tournament two weeks ago. Uh, be sure if you see Jace, Griffin, Samantha, or Alexis in the hall or in lunch or during class, don't disturb them, please, um, to congratulate them for their award. Not to take the, the shine away from them, but okay. I did I did win states when I was in sixth grade. So, like... I haven't done robotics in a long time. Our next story. <laughs> Announcement to everyone that the back doors are now strictly closed. There is no happiness allowed in iTech, and you are no longer allowed to come back in through the back doors after getting lunch. Ask Mr. Topfest why. We strongly encourage you do that. <laughs> strongly. Go ahead. Do it. <laughs> okay, anyway. New lunch info. If you haven't already noticed, the first few stairs on the ground staircase are now open for lunch. As well as the outside patio tables. The only notice, you can only sit on the purple little sticky square things on the grand staircase. But only one person per purple square. Also, this time you're not allowed to sit on the cafeteria floor anymore. Um sucks and you can no longer move the chairs either i forgot <laughs> yeah would you share a square with me no i you can't fool me this time oh man you can fool someone with the same trick twice but i guess it didn't work you went He made a new rule where if you're coming back from lunch, you have to go through the front way and not the back way. So can you please go through the back, the front way, please? Have you ever been ice skating before? No, I'm too poor for that. We're both too poor. <laughs> well, this is your chance to try it out for the first time or show off your moves. Join Key Club's fundraiser at Mountain View Ice Arena on February 11th. It's from 7.30 to 9 p.m. And tickets are $20 each. Please note that you can only purchase tickets using the form in the iTech 2022 Canvas page or the email you've received. Bring as many people as you want. And there will be awards given out for the most festive outfit. Also, 20% of what Key Club earns will go to Clark County Food Bank. If you missed any of this information, lucky for you, there will be an email sent out with all the information you will need. There will be, there are also posters around the school, obviously. Do you want to go ice skating with me? It's $20, which equals $40, so no. I'm asking you on a date. Oh, yeah, that's still a no, though. <laughs> We're this Raven Game Club is hosting another Super Smash Bros. tournament this coming Wednesday, February 9th. It's open to all students starting after school at 7 p.m. Yes, that's how long these tournaments last, but it's so worth it. Come have a blast with us. To sign up, email Jace Cooper at 133957 at studentfantasy.org, and he'll send you a form to fill out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay. I'm a We're done. We're done. We're done.